I'm kind of pissed. What's up? It's me, Lacey. I'm kind of pissed off. I just recorded a whole f five minute thing, and I had the camera the wrong way. So even though the back was facing me, it was really recording my hand because the camera was on the front camera. So pissed off, yo. Anyway, update video of all repeating myself again. Unbelievable. Second update video of AutoZone after my first day at AutoZone today. But first, before we get started, in the mail, I got a red light camera citation for $80. It's that made a right on red. There was a camera there, red light camera. All right? But there was no sign that said no turn on red. If there's a sign that says no turn on red, then you have to can't make the right on red. But if there's no sign that says no turn on red on Long Island, you can legally make the right on red. Okay? It's bullshit. I got a login and a pin that I can log in and watch a video of what I'm doing and shit. I can see where they wanted me to, to give me the ticket because it's not like I was in the right lane and I came up to the light and went into the shopping center. You know what I mean? I was going into a shopping center. I was in the middle lane and I kind of... Oh my gosh, just show you. I'm the black truck. The light turns yellow. And then here I come after the black truck in the middle, you see? And then I decide to cut across into the shopping center. And, I, and so the red light... The red light came and got me. It's red. See, there I go. Shot across. Boom. But see, there's really nothing really that illegal about it. It's like it's like if I just if I it's like almost like if I was sitting at the red light and I decide to go into the shopping center. It's a right on red. There's no traffic coming behind me. I fucking technically shouldn't have got really should get really shouldn't get the ticket. You know what I mean? So I'm gonna fight it. It's fucking eighty dollars and shit. Fuck that shit. I'm fighting that shit. Fucking fighting that shit. You know? But, uh, first day at AutoZone. Uh, quite interesting, should I say. Um, got to work at 8 o'clock this morning. What the fuck? Why is my fan not working? Uh oh. There it goes. At 8 o'clock this morning, I get to work, and I walk into the new auto zone, and it's completely empty. Okay, when I don't mean nothing on the shelves, okay, I mean there was no shelves. No counters, no shelves, it was just a big, almost like they just signed the rent papers, and they just walked into an empty fucking inside commercial building. Completely empty. It actually didn't take over a blind to go, it's right next to a blind to go, so I'm not sure what was there before, but blind to go is still next door. All right, completely empty, nothing, nothing at all. We walked into a fucking empty, big fucking empty fucking lot. All right, just imagine like they just build, they just built a fucking, let's just say, what's the equivalent to that size, all right, CVS. They just built a new CVS, right, They, and they build the building, all right, and inside of the building there's nothing, nothing at all. The only thing inside is electrical outlets. That's it, all right, nothing in there at all, no counters, no nothing, no, nothing at all, just nothing. All right, so the first thing we had to do, I'm trying <laughs> I mean, it's like, I need to, like, explain it. Like, how many times am I going to say it, right? It's just there was nothing in there. Nothing at all. So, the truck backed up. We took pallets and pallets and pallets. Hundreds and hundreds of pallets. And the first thing we did was put together sh the actual shelves and the backdrop that go along the whole inside of the building. Where you can put the shelves into, like, the holes and, ho and hooks and shit to hang stuff. And just putting the shelves together. There's still so much. I wish I took before and after pictures. It's crazy. We got a lot done today. I was there for 10 hours working. I was paid. Paid a month for 10 hours. Month. I'm do, This week I'm doing 49 hours. A little more than 50. But then they fact and then minus the hour for lunch every day. So I'm getting 49 hours already this week. Nine hours overtime. Monday through Friday, eight to six, and then Saturday just eight to 12. But it's crazy. That's a lot of hours already. But putting together shelves. Just now I see with the layout, putting together the actual counters, just putting together the shelves behind the counters where the customers don't go and where they keep all the alternator spark plugs, like all those shelves with boxes of stuff. We put those shelves together. Absolutely nothing in there. No, there's no cables for internet wires, no printers, no computers, nothing ran, no wires, nothing ran yet. It's just crazy. Nothing. It's just nuts. So when they said we were starting to help start the new store, I thought maybe I was just going to go in there and start putting merchandise on the shelves and start tagging stuff. Right, we 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 can't even do that yet because we had to put together shelves and and just a bunch of shit, backdrops, back wall panels, everything. Counters is just nuts. It was crazy. Everyone had drills and screwdrivers and just nuts. Crazy, crazy, but uh, fun. I'm definitely gonna know where everything's going now. That's for sure. I know it's just nuts. 
Maybe I'll take my phone tomorrow. I'm going to take my phone tomorrow and take a picture of what it is right now before we do anything any further. All you got to minus in your head is the palettes that are lined up with all stuff on it. Those were outside back. We didn't bring those in yet. But just you'll see all the shelving put together where stuff's going to be put on. And you'll see when I say nothing was in there, all that shit was empty. But what you see now is what we did in one day in 10 hours. It's going to be crazy. So I'll show it. I'll take pictures tomorrow when I get there at 8 a.m. I'll try to get there a little early so shit's not done yet. But uh, just crazy, guys. Crazy. I'm real cool with my, my with the manager right above me, under the main manager. I'm cool with the, the assistant manager. I'm cool with the manager. There's a lot of uh, corporate people there. I'm cool with people. Definitely probably going to get the promotion. Uh, there's, you know, there's two PSMs in this store. The assistant manager actually went down to a PSM because she just had a, a, a baby boy and she can't have too much responsibility because of the kid. But there's two PSMs now in this specific place. So that means I'm definitely not going to get one in this location. i got to strive for the next new location. But I'd probably be building another one if I, if I go to the new store in my town. I bet you I'll be building that one, doing everything I did to fucking all the next in the next two weeks again. Hey, if that's what it takes to get manager position, I'll fucking do it. Just bump me up to twelve thirteen an hour. <laughs> I don't care. But yeah, that's it, guys. And uh, I'm going to end this now, edit it real quick, throw it up. Like, it's midnight. Got to really get to bed tonight. Slept for like four hours last night, three, four hours. Got to get some more sleep tonight. So have a good night. Keep you updated. Peace.